homes and I design luxury closets. My celebrity clients trust me to create beautiful, well-organized spaces for all of their fabulous things. Subscribe for closet tours, DIY tips, and a behind-the-scenes look at LA's most glamorous closet makeovers. And check out my blog, Closet File, for more. Enjoy the video! Hey guys, it's Lisa Adams, and I'm here with my client, friend of a friend, Lydia Knight. Hi, I'm Lydia. I'm a singer and musician in a band called The Regret, and I'm now the owner of a band. <laughs> well, we're here in Lydia's closet, and we're going to give you a tour uh, and just talk about special pieces, the process, what it was like for you. Honestly, just mind blown even standing in this room <laughs> because it's been like a massive dream of mine growing uh -huh. up and movies and rom coms and seeing the crazy <laughs> closets and the shoe walls. And so, looking at this, and I'm still getting used to being like, oh, I own those things on that wall. <laughs> like, I can wear that when I want to. <laughs> um, but every day feels like I've been playing dress up or something. I have my favorite shoes now that I can show off. Okay, tell us your favorite shoe. Fall. Okay, these are my favorite, favorite shoes. Oh. <laughs> these are my little Prada, or actually very big Prada <laughs> chunky sneakers. I got these for Christmas. Oh. And I get to show them off right here, and they go well with everything. These velvet docks, because I never see them, and I got these when I was 12 or 13, and they were way too big. My dad got me them, and they oh. were massive for me, and it made no sense to grow into them. <laughs> and I did, and now nobody oh. has them, so That's I win. That's super cool. Yeah. Well, I know like this was a bedroom. Yeah, it was converted into oh your God. closet. It looked completely different. It had like ugly, hilarious carpeting. <laughs> there was a full wall over here. Right. And, yeah, right. it just it feels so big now. It's hard <laughs> to imagine that that was a wardrobe that we knocked out, and, and now, it's, now it's enveloped. Yeah, it's, it's enveloped into the space. All wardrobe. Which may look ridiculous, but for me, how do you decide what to wear? Oh my god! Well, that's what's so nice too is having it open is the decision making. Like, okay, that sweater, the decision making. These pants, like I can't right. do it. You know, all you yeah. need, all I need, and then a ton of space too in this island. I was right. surprised at how much room there is. Uh -huh. it's crazy. How do you feel about the island? Having it, do you feel like? I love Just it. Like, I, yeah. feel I feel like I can I know Kitty it. loves it. Oh yeah, my cat is obsessed with it. But like folding laundry in here right, and right. everything. And and then we added the, the light fixture yeah. and the drapes and the seating. Do you oh, find I yourself sitting? All the time. Um, That's what's so nice right. is I love like coming home with my boyfriend from a restaurant or something and like while I get ready for bed, being able to talk about whatever, finish a conversation or getting ready in the morning and having space. Like also just I love sharing clothes with my friends and so now I feel like I can provide and get ready with people right. here, which is uh, Again, in the like fantasy rom com, world, but <laughs> that's what we're doing. That's what that's we're what making you're doing. happen. <laughs>been building you know this my collection I guess you could yeah. say for since I was like 14 or 15 when I started getting really into vintage and, and thrifting in LA uh -huh. and I love mixing that with like I'm still a sucker for designer you know accessories and maybe uh -huh. some basics from like Aritzia or like certain like really good quality basics that I mix in with like weird like this, you know, that I get the Rose Bowl or whatever. Right. Like, I like my crazy like 70s stuff and then and then I'll mix that though with like a little Prada bag or something which I feel like modernizes it right, right, um, right. and elevates it and I mean anybody looks cute when you slap a nice bag <laughs> onto it, it's true. To see your personal style injected into the space, that it feels yes. so youthful, so energetic, so you. Yeah, I was nervous, honestly, about yeah. like the idea of you know a custom built closet. I was thinking yeah. of like, will it um, look you know like it's in somebody else's home right, or like right, out of right. a magazine uh -huh, or something? Uh -huh. But now, like your attention to detail and, and coming over beforehand and like right. looking at the house and talking to me about my personal style, like. Well, like this wallpaper is so unique and so, so me. Like, <laughs> it sounds so funny, but it is. It is. And the light and like matching the mirror and just every detail about it feels like I. 
I hate using this, but threw up my own personality into a closet. <laughs> I'm, I'm in awe right now. I'm still looking around like, Ooh, <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks for watching, everybody, and go to our YouTube channel to find more behind the scenes with Lydia. Yes.